Hey guys, in this session, we're going to be looking at the 10th column um, in a number. And, and this is one of the most misunderstood columns, all right? And, I, and I'll tell you why. Because um, usually what we have is, you know, if you look at the number 2, this is actually in the 1s column. And the 5 is actually in the 10s column. But what we're actually looking for is the 10th column, all right? And most of the time, what I've seen people do is they actually point this out to the 9. Uh, they actually say 9 is actually in the tenths column. And this is actually incorrect. Uh, in fact, it's it's the tenths column is actually right here. Um, and you might be wondering, well, how does that happen, all right? Well, think about it like this. You know, if we were to write um, 8 tenths, uh, let's go 8 tenths. Now, 8 tenths is the same thing as saying 8 over 10. And if you look at the calculator that I've got um, just up here running, and if I actually do 8 divided by 10, uh, that's actually going to give me 0 0.8. And so this is kind of like a, a common misunderstanding people have. Um, so after the decimal, there is no, um, uh, sometimes I've, I've heard kids say, what about the one column? And it's like, well, you don't really have the one column because that's the same thing as saying once. Um, you know, if you think about it, two lots of ones is just two. So you don't really have a one column so it just ends up being the tenth um, and of course after the tenth you've got the 100th column uh, so this ends up being uh, the 100th um, column and so on um, so let's have a look at a couple of examples real quickly here so what happens if um, let's put a couple of examples here so let's say we've got the number 3.07 uh, then we can say um, in this case um, zero is in the tenths, tenths column. All right, so what about if we have something like a number like this, 0 0.0005, and if they ask you what's in the tenths column, again, we still only look at the number after the decimal point. So in this case, also, we're going to say zero is actually in the tenths column. So, yeah, that's pretty much it for this uh, short little video, guys. So just keep in mind that the tenths column is after the decimal point. Uh, is the number to the right of the decimal point. Um, but, yeah, that's basically it for this video. Um, thank you for watching.